Have you ever wondered what the best investment is to achieve financial freedom quickly? I'm often asked all the time, Joe, what can I invest in to help me achieve financial freedom quickly so that I can be able to do the things I wanna do and help the people I wanna help? I wanna help break this down for you and I wanna give you truth and some examples on how you can create financial freedom quickly but also what the best investment is. My name is Joe Moffitt with Master Life by Design and today's video is the number one investment you can make for financial freedom. All right, let's jump in because all the time I hear there's great investments to Bitcoin or stocks or real estate or there's so many different ways. Now on our path to financial freedom, a lot of us think, hey, maybe it's real estate, maybe it's Bitcoin or stocks or 401ks or you know a startup business. There's so many different ways you can achieve financial freedom but I want to share with you the number one way that you actually do this and if you've ever found someone who's achieved financial freedom what you're going to find is they all more than likely have done this one thing so you might be wondering Joe what is that one thing the number one investment that you can make with your money is not real estate it's not Bitcoin it's not starting a business the number one thing that you can do to accelerate financial freedom is invest in you. Now, look, I know it sounds corny, but it's absolutely true. And I'm gonna give you three ways that actually help me accelerate my path towards financial freedom. And I continue to do every single day, every single week, every single month, and every single year to keep moving ahead because I believe we're called that we have this God-given gift within us, we're called to use that to create something great in this world and to help other people. Other people, right? And so we're not going to just reach this pinnacle, this top, and just celebrate saying, hey, look at me. We wanna be able to turn around and give a helping hand to other people. And I say a helping hand because I only have one because my wrist is still broken. So it comes off in a week. Super excited about that, all right? So let's jump in. Let me give you three key areas that you can do to invest in you so that you can accelerate financial freedom. So the first one is extremely simple and it doesn't cost much at all, if not free. And that is books. You can invest in books. And the reason why I love books and it's really a beneficial tool towards helping improve you and investing in you is You've got people who have mastered a subject. They spend decades learning the ins and outs and how to be the most effective and greatest tools and strategies to turn that area of life around. And what they've done is they've taken decades of their life and put it into one book that you can consume. In fact, my greatest time when I love to consume books is while I'm driving. I call my vehicle my mobile university because I am learning from some of the greatest minds throughout history that have allowed me, hear me clearly, that have allowed me to be influenced the way that they think. Books, put this in your notes, books help you think differently. Okay, and from a neuroscience perspective, the more that you can learn and educate yourself, especially around your topic or your industry of mastery in your marketplace, is when you actually learn different things, your brain, as you think, can start to make new neuro connections in the brain to come up with different ideas for you to be able to go to that next level, whatever that might be. So books allow you to fall time, like decades. Now you don't have to read books and you can go try to figure these areas out and spend years or decades on it, but why not get a book or an audiobook where you can put it on 2x speed and actually get the way that individual thinks about that specific topic inside of you so that you can create new, new neuro pathways. You can come up with new ideas for your business or your company to go to that next level to bring more revenue in, especially passively, so you can create financial freedom. Books are powerful. So let me give you my top three books that I believe can help you on your path to financial freedom. The first one is Think and Grow Rich by Napoleon Hill. I love this book. It is one of the best sellers of all time. I think the Bible's number one, and then this is a quick number two, I believe. However, Think and Grow Rich has so many great principles of success from dozens of multimillionaires that Napoleon Hill has studied throughout time. Okay, so that's the first book. The second book is Rich Dad Poor Dad by Robert Kiyosaki. I love this book because it actually teaches you the four quadrants and where you might be. It helps you identify where you are and where you might wanna go next or your ultimate goal of where you want to be. And when we're talking about financial freedom and passive income here at Master Life by Design, you wanna to get to the investor 
uh, quadrant, excuse me, what category, whatever you want to call it. I don't care, but you want to get there, but there's practical steps on how to get there. But the first step is you got to change the way you think. And that's why books help you do that. And so number three is a book called The Millionaire Next Door, which I absolutely love. And there was one, one section in that book that really hit me. <clears throat> And it really brings me around the topic of humility because the, he said in his book, there are people who are decamillionaires who live right next door to you and you have no idea because they don't have a fancy house, they don't have the fancy car, the fancy clothes, lavish trips. They have money in the bank or in investments or passive income coming in and you don't even know because they don't live above their means. This is a really data-driven book. So if you can get through the data um, and get the nuggets, it's so beneficial. That changed me. That changed the way I thought about how I'm going to show up as I'm making more and more money because I don't want to be the boastful one. Right. If there's only one thing I can boast about, it, it's, that's my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. I'll boast about him all day. However, for me, I learned to be humble on my walk. This book is great for that. It helped me with that. But it also shows some really good statistics about, you know, where people are in their financial path. So anyway, check that book out. All right. So the second one is coaching. Now, I know I'm speaking biasly because I'm all about coaching. I've been doing it for a decade, but it's literally changed my life and so many of my clients and so many people around the world who not just have worked with me, but have worked with other coaches. Coaching is so powerful because like in a vehicle, we all have a blind spot. We can't see these spots and we're always creating new ones on our path and on our journey because I believe at every new level, there's a new devil and we don't always see that devil coming, right? And so we have to make sure that we have someone in our corner who can be at that 50,000 foot view and see the whole terrain that you're walking on. Because if you're walking in a forest, you can only see you know, so far ahead of you. But if you had someone that was above the forest, they could see and help you navigate that path so you don't get lost forever like Moses in the wilderness, right? And so with that being said, coaching's powerful. I've had a client when he came to me, he was making roughly around $5,000 a month working as a contractor for this company. He wanted to improve his income. He just didn't have an idea on how to do that. We started working through and discovering some things. And one of the biggest challenges that showed up that he didn't want to address was his fear around asking for more money because he knew his worth on the inside, but he didn't want to share it on the outside by having the conversation. We worked through that fear. He had a conversation, one conversation, and they knew the value that he provided and they doubled his income from that moment on. So he went from five grand a month to $10,000 a month, all because of a conversation. Now, can I say that's gonna happen to you by talking to your boss or someone that you work with? Maybe not, but possibly. But there is conversations I bet that you know you need to have, but you're allowing fear to get in the way. Or maybe there's a relationship you wanna start, whether an intimate one with someone or a business relationship, and you have fear holding you back. If you never work through that, you'll never get the blessing that's on the other side, okay? So coaching can be powerful. This same client, he also then later down the road had a fear of partnering with some people he thought he could add value to, and he put that off. As we worked through that fear, he had those conversations, he made, a, he used his people skills that we help coach him around, and as a result, he created a unique partnership with two other people. This business, went on for a few years where after about the first year of investing and they finally started breaking even, I remember the day he told me he was gonna get his first payout. And his first payout was over $100,000. He went on to eventually be making $300,000 a month because we broke through the fear that was holding him back from what he knew he could bring to the table. And as he had that conversation, he was able to create a lifestyle that was far above and beyond anything that he imagined or dreamed of, but he got to reap that reward because he worked through it with his coach, me. And so he was able to break through. I know from working with other coaches and, and my other colleagues that they have similar success stories of people taking their business to the next level. It's because you can only see so much. You can only see in so many different directions. You have to have someone that has your back in your corner, pointing you out, pointing out those blind spots, calling you out and holding you accountable. Coaching is extremely powerful. 
And that's why, um, like in the book Relentless, if you've ever read that book, right, Michael Jordan and Kobe Bryant's coach, right, he held them to a high standard. And accountability was off the charts. All the greats have a coach. But here's what I found that's in common. Those that are not great do not have a coach. So you tell me, would that help accelerate you towards financial freedom? I think so. All right, lastly is Mastermind. Now, let me back up because I told you about one of my greatest favorite books is Think and Grow Rich. And in that book, they talk about the power of a mastermind. And so when you have two or three or four people or more come together, the accumulative power that comes with that, with new ideas, new strategies, new ways of thinking, combining things that are in different people's wheelhouses to help you go to that next level is extremely powerful. And so I've been in masterminds for a few years now. I'm in a specific mastermind. There's a great book called Tribe of Millionaires. I love this book because it, for me as a man, it brings a brotherhood as a woman, it brings that sisterhood together about what it's like to truly be part of a mastermind. Now, ironically, the book Tribe of Millionaires that I'm referring to actually is part of the founding, I'll say fathers of a fictional story of a uh, mastermind I'm part of called Go Bunnets, which is really real estate focused, or at least most people are real estate focused in there. You don't have to join that one. If you do, let me know, reach out. I wanna be able to give you a referral for that. I get credit, you get credit for that. However, you can join any mastermind out there. There's a ton of them. What I would suggest is find a mastermind with two things. One, it's in your wheelhouse of what you're looking to achieve. I'm primarily focused on real estate, and so I wanna be part of a real estate mastermind. If you're looking to grow your business around online fitness coaching, get in a mastermind of other people because you can discuss the ideas and strategies that work for you and for others and so that you can go to that next level. The second part is the accountability. Studies have shown that when you are accountable, you can have up to 98% success by that accountability group. And so I like to be in a group of men that hold me accountable to go to that next level, to play life on offense and not defense, to take new ground and new territory instead of shrinking. And so I love that. And when we get around other people who are doing the same thing, we, when we win and when you win and we win collectively, it all takes us to that next level, right? And it's the old saying that a rising tide raises all ships. And when you're in a mastermind group of people who are winning, it raises the standard in your life, it gets you out of complacency, gets you back on offense so you can take new territory, new ground, not just for you, all right, hear me clearly. When you have success, it's not just for you. Yeah, you can enjoy it, but it's who's on the other side of that success because you stepped up, because you invested in you. And I'll tell you one thing, when you invest in yourself, whether it's through books, coachings, or masterminds, you're laying a foundation that can never be taken away from you. Who I've become as a result of investing hundreds of thousands of dollars into these areas here, I will tell you, I've changed. I will never go back to who I was. I will continue to get better. It's like you're, lay, you're putting a layer of bricks down every time you read a book. And then you read another book, it's another layer of bricks. And another, then you get in coaching, then you get in masterminds and you keep adding these layers. And next thing you know, you build a fortress of a winning kingdom. Right? You build this fortress around you where you are impenetrable and you are only declaring victory over the areas that you're attacking in your life. So with that, I find value in all three of these. They've helped me accelerate my path to financial freedom. Dozens and hundreds of people that I've coached accelerate on their path to financial freedom. And so if you're like, hey, I wanna accelerate, I wanna go to that next level, get into some of those books I recommended. There's masterminds all out there and get a coach. If you want myself to coach you or one of my coaches here at Master Life by Design to help you, then reach out, fill out the application. We'll put the link below for you in the uh, comment section. Make sure that you get a, you fill out that application and you get a coach because I will tell you, money comes and goes. It really does. Time, you can never get back. So allow us to help fold time for you so that you can go to your next level, okay? So with that, I'm excited for all you guys to plug in, get in those books, love to 
year? What decisions did you make? What books did you read? Who did you hire as your coach? What mastermind are you a part of? Put it in the comments below. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up and most importantly, subscribe. Put Hit that notification button too so you know when new videos like this come out because it's one piece of information that could radically transform your life forever. And if you don't plug into it, you might miss it. And I, that's not what I desire for you. So with that, thanks for watching, guys. My name's Joe Moffitt with Master Life by Design. Have a great one. See you guys.